Hey YouTube family, happy Thanksgiving. I am stuck in a truck stop in Bloomington, Illinois. Um, figured this was coming, so it's not a big deal. I know that being on the road is gonna be times like this. Shannon is in Salt Lake City. Um, I think he's gonna be staying either at the terminal, um, he might be at a truck stop right now, but his trainer is going home for Thanksgiving and then also his trainer um, his mom is having some medical problems so that's kind of up in the air right now on if he's going to continue training with him or whatnot. So we'll see over the weekend. But anyways, he's there and I'm here. We're headed to Texas to deliver a load of sweet and Sara Lee. So um, what's happened since then? A lot has happened back and forth across the country a lot just trucking along getting those miles in um, still doing a friendly competition with Shannon and our trainers try to get the mileage in as fast as we can we're hoping to be done first week of December around there um, and on the road in our own truck by Christmas um, so I went over Cabbage Pass in Oregon, between Idaho and Oregon. Apparently that was a big deal. It was nighttime, so it wasn't so freaky, but on the way there, my trainer told me there were hairpin turns at 35 mile an hour coming down a hill. And when you top the hill before you start coming down, you can see the valley of city lights below. That was a little intimidating, but I do have to say it prepared me for it. And, um, you know, got my guard ready for it. What I wasn't prepared for was the huge river I was going to be following after that. So the Columbia River you follow all the way into Seattle almost. Um, again it was dark so I couldn't see but um, every now and then I could see the lights from across the lake shining across the lake and on my GPS you could just see this black mass alongside the road that you're driving along. You're driving literally on the edge of the river. Um, so that was exciting, interesting, a little nerve-wracking. I got to see it on the way up in the day. Beautiful, beautiful country. I'd love to go back and we would have a little bit more time, stop and see a few places, really take it in. Um, but anyways, I'll update you some more. And in the meantime, happy Thanksgiving. <laughs> 